Hundreds of American medical students who are still stranded on the island of Dominica a full eight days after the hurricane hit. ABC's Ian Panel with them as they try to get out and the U.S. military backed by special forces is now sweeping that island tonight. Tonight, the race to rescue hundreds of American students stranded on this Caribbean island ravaged by Hurricane Maria. Some have been stranded for over a week as the island's residents face dire conditions. The destruction on the island is, is shocking. I mean, in parts, buildings have just been completely blown away. People are short of food, they're short of electricity. Have your numbers out. An international team working to evacuate students from Dominica with incredible stories of survival. One girl, her entire house went out and she was just holding on to the, to the, floor, to the floorboards like yeah. for the entire storm. Her face, she, I saw her face at like 2.30 in the morning, her face was just red from the wind, not from crying, just from the wind in her face. So after this, we're brothers, not friends. You don't go through catastrophe and not have family afterwards. And tonight, all those students now on their way home and to safety. So all students off the island, but that doesn't mean all Americans rescued. U.S. Special Forces, together with the military, are scouring the island. But don't forget those who call this home. They have no escape plan. David? Ian Panel with us tonight. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.